Hi guys, this is Kasia from exoticacademy.com, the online platform for learning exotic pole, floor work and chair dancing. And today I have for you a beginner intermediate, moderately slow choreo, maybe a bit of an overstatement, a routine where we can practice very cool transitions. It's dark and flowy, you can probably guess my favorite style by now. And we are dancing to an easy song with a very predictable and constant beat. But I really want you to focus on execution, finishing off every line, extending every move without worrying about being on time with music too much and rushing things. It's fairly short. We only have seven or eight eights. We're gonna divide it into two parts. We can pause, rewind, skip. Don't forget about the warm up, knee pads. As usual, I'll be explaining facing the mirror. So you have the back view like in a studio and the mirror view as a reference. If you try it, I would love to see it. So don't forget to tag Exotic Dance Academy on Instagram. So our starting position is with the pole between our legs. We're going to rest on the left, in my case, left hip and bring the leg that is closer to the audience, bend our feet nice and pointed. I'm going to bring the hand that is further away from the audience quite low so I can then arch back and I'm going to rest here, wait for the beat to start. As the beat starts, I'm going to lean back, arch my back, extend that leg with feet pointed, and I'm going to reach back. From here, I'm going to make a rotation with my right leg. And to do that, I need to close my hips and face my hip bones away from the audience. So I can make a nice rotation. Because if I do that with my hip bones facing to the ceiling, I won't have that range of motion. So, extend, reach back, close the hips. So now my glutes are facing to the audience and I can make a rotation open. From here, I'm going to bring that leg to the other side, bending both legs hooking onto the pole, leaning forward. From here, I'm going to straighten both legs and the top leg is going to bend and I'm going to place my heel on my knee. So I'm creating a nice shape with my legs. I'm going to bring the legs back to the right and as I do that, I'm going to slide my calf on my shin. So I'm creating a nice shape from here. Boom. From here, I'm going to push myself and roll over. So in this position, I want my back arched, my toes pointed. So I'm going to roll over in front of the pole, my belly, initiating the move with my hair. Feet are constantly pointed. From here, I'm gonna get ready for a sexy downward dog. So I'm going to place my hands around chest and I'm going to arch my back and slide my feet forward. Then I'm gonna bring my hips up, keeping my back nice and straight. Arch and drop the knee that is further away from the audience on the floor. 
From here, I'm gonna draw a circle with my right hip. Okay, so let's practice from the top. This hand is quite low. Beat starts. Five, six, seven, eight. Arch, reach back, close the hips, rotation, open. Close. Nice shape with the legs. Slide the calf on the shin. Roll over, initiating with the hair. Come up to a sexy downward dog. Drop the left knee on the floor and circle with the hip. So practice that a few times and let's move on. From here, I'm gonna get ready to bring that outside leg, slide it on the floor and bring it in front into a lunge. And I'm going to keep on sliding that foot, keeping my toes nice and pointed. And I'm going to turn to swap my lunging leg. And I'm gonna get ready to come up through this common and cool transition. So I'm going to push my hips forward and place my body weight to the outside left leg. And I'm going to bring my hand onto the pole in a thumb down grip. I'm going to slide that leg around and come up. So you really want to have this leg in contact and sliding on the floor at all times. This will give you a nice uh, continuous flow, we movement, and you really want to keep that leg pointed as well if possible. From here, I'm going to bring my head in front of the pole, careful not to hit your head, and I'm going to do a hair flick. I'm going to get ready to bring my outside leg around. So I'm going to use a half bracket grip. So I'm pushing away with my outside hand and I'm going to place my body weight on my right leg and bring the left leg with a nice sliding motion on the floor. Turn to face to the audience. I'm just holding myself with the inside arm in a basic grip and I am trying to stay on the point if possible. And from here, I'm going to drop down to lean against the pole with my back. And as I do that, I'm going to make a nice hip movement. So the front leg is nice and pointed, creating a nice shape. From here, I'm going to turn to the left through a pointed feet and over the platform. I can now swap the grip from a twisty to cup grip and I continue to sliding my outside leg to come into an outside leg lunge. And this is part one. So let's practice from the top slowly. You can try a few times and then we can try it with music. So we're resting on our left hip. Five, six, seven, eight. Lean back, arch, reach back. Hips, rotation, open. Leg across, come into a ball. Nice shape with the legs. Slide the cap on your shin. Roll over on your belly. Sexy downward dog. Drop the left knee on the floor. Outside hip is making a circle. Slide the foot to a lunge. Cross your knees. Turn. 
swap the lunging leg body weight to the front leg slide head in front of the pole hair flick regrip grab higher half bracket grip pushing away placing the body weight on the right foot drawing a large circle extend drop feet pointed hips in front of the pole tilt over on your left platform regrip to a cup grip the leg continue to slide coming into an outside leg lunge The second part so from here we dropped change the grip into a cup grip and we are going to slide that leg into an outside leg lunge and prepare for that next transition so this transition can be a little bit challenging you will need that momentum from that drop to go straight into it we're going to bring the outside hand onto the pole quite high in a normal basic grip and the bottom hand we're going to bring onto the pole in a half bracket grip and we're going to help ourselves with that bottom hand pushing away from the pole. We're going to shift the body weight to the outside leg and slide the inside leg around in front. So you want to probably practice that if you haven't tried this transition before. So you, as you come up, you want to have a nice pointed feet already. You want to turn your hips and you want to place your body weight on the leg that is further away from the audience and you want to keep the leg that is closer to the audience nice and pointed and straight. And as you turn, you stay quite low and the head comes last. So this creates a nice flowy transition so so you can practice that a few times if you haven't tried this transition yet pull push slide body weight on the leg that is further away from the audience head stays low until the last moment boom from here you want to bring that leg back to the center, step, turn towards the pole. So you want to have that outside hand, bottom hand in a thumb down grip to help you with the balance. Turn towards the pole. Now we're going to bring the legs up and we're going to use a normal double handshake grip, double basic grip. So I'm going to Pull, make a pull up, bring my legs up. Make a nice cycling with my feet and I'm going to drop down with the pole in between my legs and I am resting on my right hip. From here, I'm going to arch back and I'm going to open my right leg, my outside leg to the side. So that leg is just sliding on the floor 
depending on your flooring, this may be easier or harder, okay? So we're opening our legs into a nice shape. From here, we're going to rotate, slide that leg on the floor, and open to the right, close our knees, and roll over in front of the pole. So you want to make sure that you have enough space here. Open, come onto your belly, feet together, roll to the other side. Open again, and from here you want to tilt over the left platform and continue that rotation and sliding your feet on the floor. So we landed here, arch back, open. So that foot stays for now locked behind the pole. I'm going to rotate, bring it to the other side, open, close, roll over in front of the pole, open, and I'm going to tilt through the left platform, making sure I bring my hips up, so I have enough space to slide my feet under. I'm going to continue sliding my foot on the floor, bring it into an outside leg lunge again. Half bracket grip, push, open the hips, stand up, head comes last. So let's practice the second part from the drop so we have some speed. So from that drop, re-grip, outside leg lunge, slide, hair, step, turn, pull up, drop, arch, open, roll, Open the knees, close, roll, tilt, outside leg lunge, open, head comes last, well done. And now you can try the second part with music. having a good workout because I am pretty hot by now but let's try everything from the top slowly and then with music ready okay so our starting position back nice and straight hand low waiting for the song to start five six seven eight arch back Reach back, extend the leg. Hips, rotation, open. Bring the leg in front. Come into a ball. Extend. Heel on the knee. Slide the leg. Roll over in front of the pole. Sexy, downward dog. Drop the knee, circle with the hip. Slide your outside leg to the front, come up. Keep on sliding, knees cross. Turn around, swap your lunging leg. Come up, leg is sliding on the floor. Head in front of the pole, hair flick, re-grip, push, 
slide face to the audience, drop. So most of your body weight is on the top arm. The front leg is nice and pointed. Tilting to the left over the left platform. Coming onto the left knee, cap grip. Slide, lunge. Get ready to come up, slide, head. Bring that leg to the center, step, turn. Pull, leg, leg, drop. Arch, open. The left leg stays behind the pole. Roll over, open the knees to the right. Make sure you have enough space. Knees together, roll to the other side. Hips up. Rolling through that Attitude position, I guess we could say. Keep on sliding. Outside leg lunge. Open. Come up. Well done. Thank you.